All right, here's all our food. Got everything packed. This is Tom's bag. This is my bag. Everything fit. We're doing a food drop. So we got half of the food for the entire 100 mile wilderness in the bags. And then the other half is in this bucket. We're gonna pick this up on like day five or six on the actual trail. That's gonna help out a lot because this bucket is heavy. It's worth it, worth it. Yeah, so that costs uh, $35 to do if you're gonna do that, but definitely worth it, 100%. Because that's a lot of weight. It's probably a solid, how much do you think, Tom? 20, 25 pounds. Yeah, that's it. This would be the first weighing with all the food. And water. And water. <sighs> oh, whoa, buddy. Dang. <laughs> oh, yeah, because we don't, we'll only have one. Oh, without this, I'm at 34. All right. That'll do it. That's our weights. We will be going down to uh, one liter of water and then just have the other one for whenever we need to fill it up with 30 water. So with that, I'm sitting at about 34 pounds. And were you about the same? You're at 35. Yeah, see, we made it by one pound. <laughs> cool. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right, this is old man. He runs the lodge here. And it's been great. This is a great place. And there's Tom. Well, it. it's been a pleasure having you guys here, and all I can say is enjoy the journey. Awesome, thanks. It, it can be a it can be a life changer. Yeah, it was for me. It was for many people. So enjoy it out there. It's not about the miles. It's about the journey, the, the people, journey, the, the towns, the whole experience. It's really it doesn't get much better than this. Awesome. And just know you're gonna have good days. You're gonna have bad days. Yeah. Don't quit on the bad Don't days. Don't ever quit on a bad day. Yep. Yeah. Getting down to the zero hour. Yeah. We're gonna be going into the park, so we'll see you then. All right. Okay. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we said our goodbyes to Old Man Navigator here at the lodge. We got about an hour to kill before going to the park. So we're just hanging out on this uh, very lovely couch. And I think I'm about to start working on a video on my phone with my earbuds. Got our bags in the back of the car. We're ready to go. I'm ready. Because <laughs> uh, we like to, old man and I like to make trips to Monson every once in a while and say hi to people. Oh, so. yeah. <laughs> Try to that hook up with our treat. people again. Yeah, that'd be cool, yeah. Yeah, yeah. that'd be a treat. All right, we are yeah. leaving. Bye. Thank you for everything. Yeah, thanks for everything. This is great. Thank you. Great Thank you. I'm glad you, you've been so some much. really great guinea pigs, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Yeah, because the boys have Take you're gonna go to Monson? You too. Enjoy you very much. Enjoy, it. enjoy your hike. Just keep this in check and you'll be Oh, yeah. yeah. That's the biggest thing. Don't let this get the best of you. Yeah. 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 It was nice meeting you guys. Nice yeah. meeting you. Sweet. We just got checked in. Let me tell you how much more comfortable I am with this bug net on already. The mosquitoes are ridiculous already.
this is us. We got a lean to, so we're actually just gonna set the tents up in here. Oh, we got a fire pit, fantastic. Right next to the water. So this is actually where we will get our water from, right here. We still have to filter it and all that stuff, but it doesn't get much fresher than that. This place is incredible. Tom's gonna try out the water filter. But first, he's got to fill up the water bottle. What, what do you got? You got pizza? And pasta. Oh, that's from last night? Last night. <laughs> this birthday cake? Birthday cake. Nice. Yes. <laughs> one for me, one for you. Oh, cool. So I guess with this, we'll just have to, uh, I think it's like every time you go into town, you just do a back flush on it. You just take basically the nozzle that comes with it and do it reverse and squirt it up into the filter just so it flushes everything back out. And then it's good to go again. I heard that you don't really have to do it, but I think if you do it, it's like, like regular maintenance thing. It, it'll just ensure that you don't have any issues with it. So that's probably what we're gonna do. You can taste the minerals for sure. That is some mineral water right there. Plants for bugs. Plants for bugs. Oh. So right there you got some broadleaf plantain. Um, those came off of two separate bunches, but they grow like opposing, so the leaves will all fold out away from each other. Um, and they stay pretty close to the ground. They're really fibery, um, but there's an oil in there that helps pull things. So like I took an herbalist class and they taught us it with having use with stinging nettles, bug bites, splinters. You work the, the leaf, get the oils going, and then I rub it on the bug bites, or if I've gotten a splinter, put it Ooh. on there overnight, and it helps draw it back to the surface really well. Okay, so you mush um, it like this? Yeah, you'll notice, like, the leaf gets, like, a little and This darker. is one of the leaves, too? Yeah, so those just came off of a different, um, different thing. So this one's a different one, actually. Oh, um, it's whatever. starting to get dark on the back side. Yeah, so the more you do that, and it'll get all like that, you'll start feeling some more of it on your hand too. And yeah, it's just getting a little sticky. Blot it up and rub it so right onto the spot. So this is for the itching, yeah. not to So this will stop mosquito bite itches. Right, so not Ooh. as far as a like prevention, That's but like a, you know, after, after the fact. Okay. Okay. Right. Um, so this one here is Canada Mayflower. As I broke the stem off, you'll find some mixed stuff about it, depending on what you, you look at. Um, for a little while, I was using this because I kept mixing it up with the plantain. Um, oh, yeah. Works feel, just feel as well. Nice. I, mm. I found like I have mm. seen some things that if people make a tea with it and they do it a lot, um, one of the compounds like is cumulative effect. Your body doesn't like push it back out without go. help of another plant. Um, so yeah, as far you, as that you can goes, feel all the liquid coming out. You know, don't go, don't go making teas with the stuff unless you you do some digging on it. But Canada Mayflower, it has just this narrower stem. These kind of grow by themselves. I've used both. The plantain works a lot better. Um, but the plantain the was is this one? Yeah, so that's the plantain. Well, that dude was super cool. Never really talked to a park ranger before anywhere, but that was awesome. He was very, very knowledgeable about a lot of things. Now that we're done with that, we're gonna get back to what we were originally doing, and that is making a fire. This is a massive raven. So 
we're getting our fire going. See, I got mine though. I, don't mess with the middle. Don't touch it. Oh yeah, that's good to go now. Uh, it's like 4.30, I think. We made fire. Okay, first time testing out the bear bag throw up here on the training pole. If you guys hear that, it's from me. Remember that. So it wasn't heavy enough to bring it down. So we need to get a throw bag. <laughs> I think that's gonna be the easiest thing to do. That rope is bright though. There's no missing it. <laughs> yeah, you gotta tie a carabiner on the, the end and then you put that through the carabiner and then the carabiner catches on a stick. <laughs> that was a struggle. Use your hat. Alright. <laughs> Here we go. I'm starving. That was a struggle. Yes! He did it. That's the twelve. We're about to have our dinner. This is mine for the night. Just a, a store-bought sandwich. A $4 sandwich. And Miss Angela here has leftover pizza and pasta. That's gonna be the best camp food ever. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had pasta. Oh, I just missed it. But she tried to feed herself spaghetti through the bug net. It I looked sure just did. like that. <laughs> And Tom's got a calzone. Birthday dinner, not bad. <laughs> For dessert, we got a huge whoopie pie. This makes up for the sandwich. Yeah. For sure. <laughs> First whoopie pie. Is it a whoopie pie? Yep. First whoopie pie. Oatmeal. Oatmeal cream. and cream. Whoopie pie. All right, ending this day, first day in Baxter State Park, and it's been amazing. This place is so cool. Got the fire going in the background. Here it is. I'm using my headlamp for the first time. That's too bright, so let me dig it down. Yeah. Look, at me, look at me now. It's a little chilly. I don't think it's that bad, but uh, it's gonna be cold in the morning. And we're gonna start the crack of dawn. Dawn is 4.30. So whether or not that happens, I don't know. Oh wait, no, we're, we're doing that and then we're doing breakfast. Uh, we are now pros at bear bags in general. We're, you know, pros. We're, we're pros. We're just the best there's ever been. Got it, first, got it try, first try. First try every time. Which is funny, because I don't think anybody else here is doing bear bags. Yeah. <laughs> or it, well, they have just, their cars. If not, well, yeah, that's they true. Have yeah, they have cars. Yeah, that's it. First night in Baxter, spending uh, Angela's birthday here. Yeah, yeah. Where is she? All right, all right. There she is. <laughs> it is pretty cool. Tomorrow's the day, guys. This is the official start. We're doing Katahdin. Mm -hmm. That's it. We're doing Katahdin. We're coming back down, and we're coming back here to camp. <laughs> Everybody else that was at the lodge should be here as well. Bless you. Thank you. And. I think they have it worse than us because they have to come here and then they have to do Katahdin. Why are you sneezing so much? What's I'm really cold. You sneeze I when you're sneeze cold? I sneeze when I'm cold. Angela when sneeze sneezes when, when she's cold. Then you sneeze when you're hot too? Change of temperature and change oh. in smells. I sneeze. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Be on the lookout for that one, guys. It's going to be amazing. This is the day that we've been waiting for. We got great weather for it. It's going to be yes. fantastic. Yes. Damn, damn top. It's going to be a great day. So make sure you guys subscribe, and then I'll see you tomorrow. What? What's that? Follow, like, subscribe. <laughs>